Yo, welcome back to episode number four, I believe. Um, in last episode, if you haven't seen it, go check, take a look. We're basically starting this one off right where we left off on the last episode. We're going to be going taking down the fairy ring part one and uh, doing some birdhouse runs along the way. So I hope you enjoy. Grab your popcorn and let's go for a ride. In a world of heroes and legends. Me, Iron Dutch Boy. And friends. Drazzy Six Horse Seven. Hi. Iron Wolf Boy. Hi, everyone. Grubby Gavin. Hello. And together, we're the Iron Miss So getting right into it, you can see we're doing a little bit of fire making. Um, I took a break from questing here just so I could go and do some winter time with the boys. Um, for those who are new to group Iron Man, it's actually like one of the metas and best things you can do. I think it's kind of boring, but it is to literally get 50 fire making and go to winter time until you're 99 fire making. So that's kind of what some of the guys are doing. Um, I'm taking a little bit different route, but I wanted to go enjoy this boss with, with the boys. So that's what I did. There you go, G slice. Gavin the Grubby on 33 KC <laughs> just got us a dragon axe from Winter God. <laughs> Absolutely Dude, insane. Uh, <laughs> Draz, enjoy that right now. Well, oh man, I can't. That's not what I expected. Yeah, me neither. I mean, you can use it right now if you want to. I know you're trying to level it. I'm 39. Yeah, I am 39. Wood 61 cutting. is what you need. Oh, can you not use it? No. 30. <laughs> we hit 51 fire making. We are now at Winter Todd. We took a little break from Questies to come do some Winter Todd with Grubby Gav. Let's Hello, go. What's going on? <laughs> Dragon Axe. Oh, money right off the hey, bat. Money, though. And money. money. Oh, oh back my God. It was the same drop. It was the same. <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> fire making coming in. Let's go. Oh, that's the Pyromancer top coming in on kill count number five. Let's go. That's lucky. We like that. We like the RNG right there. I never get that. All yeah, right. We're just doing some winter tood, and we got Jurazzy over here getting us full Zerikin mage armor. That's a big, I don't know how to pronounce it, so. We got the crates, we got to do an opening here soon. We're going to throw that in the bank. Thank you, Drazzy. That's a level. That's 64. Fire making! Lego! And you're going to what? 65? Less than an hour until you're done with your grind? Yeah. Dude, I'm on my last level right now, too. Nice. Yours will go much faster. Yeah, I'm only 19k away. 75 like, fire making. That's hey, what I have on my main, bro. That's a game. You have one more game left. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then the grand crate opening. Let's go. We hit 66 fire making. Haven't opened a crate since 52, guys. Let's get it. First crate. Oh, the board Very gloves. Nice. There's the gloves <laughs> right off the bat. I have two pieces. Dude, I, I got the top, the too. Really? Yeah, I got the top I of the my top. first one. Dude, I only have one piece still. I've, I've gotten two vermin torches, so. Come on, where's the coin drops? Give us some coin drops. There's the money. What is that? Harlander seeds? Avento seeds? Earret seeds? Some money? Some fishies? Oh, the hood! Oh my, oh my god. god, I'm getting god. decked out. I'm getting decked out. It's insane. More money? Burnt pages? That's a collection log slot. Not bad. Dude, how about it's got the it's kind of crazy now it's got the tone down. Got the Gavin yeah, got the fire. That's a freaking dragon axe. Alright, second set here. Dragon X. Dragon X. Dragon X. Dragon X. Dragon X. Oh. Money. Gold mithril. Burnt pages, more money. Dude, that's not mine. More money! Ruby. More money! Teak seeked. Hell yeah. Ugh, icky. <laughs> icky. Money! Dragon X! More gloves! Hey, you can oh, turn the gloves in? in? You can turn the gloves in for another box. 
Just it's just a once a singular thing though, or fifty burnt pages. Oh really? Mm -hmm. I'm doing the hand in. Wow, right, we got the the box money. Insane, decent loot there. Do you have the full set now? No, I'm missing the legs and the boots. We had the broom and torch. Ugh. Not bad. Oh, you don't have the torch. Dude, Fairy Tales Part 1, you have to run all over the goddamn map. Good quest, it's it. It'll be bad. Quests are so fun, dude. They're like a blast. Mm hmm. 61 quests completed out of 164. Like, I'm almost I'm closing in on halfway. <laughs> <laughs> Just uh, sitting here, killing the Tanglefoot with the magic secretars and my nine farming guys. We're flinching it because it pumps my ass. See you in 45 minutes. Thirty-seven hours later, we got the kill on the Tanglefoot. Time to turn the quest in. <laughs> oh man, that's funny. <laughs> yeah, that's Very funny. We're one. all like awake. We're just like, oh my gosh, what is going? On? <laughs> uh... Guys, creature Frankenstein completed. That took way too fucking long. Way too long. But we're thirty-two thieving now. We can pickpocket from rogues. And. Please, I hated this quest so much. Soul's Bane completed. You love quests. Soul's Bane fucking sucks. You love it. God, this quest fucking sucks. That's Lost Tribe completed. Bone. Bolts and Dorgish and Crossbow unlocked. Ah, just trying to start Death of Dorgishin, but need two sets of ham robes, and I need fucking boots. I have a full inventory of everything else, and I just need some fucking boots. But you're right, Draz. I'm out here just getting getting ham robes for the team. That's what I'm doing, right? Uh, it's not just about you, you know. You gotta do it for the teammates. Getting ham robes for the team is my fucking dream. Oh, why, yes. I see you have full ham. You want to come do this quest now? Death the Dorgishin completed. 31 range. Let's go. I'm not gonna lie, man. Doing the uh, starting fairy tale part two before you do the giant dwarf. Worth it. Because now we go to Mud Skipper Point, which is across the map, but there happens to be a conveniently a fairy ring at AIQ right next to where I need to go. Mm. Saves a little bit of time. You just at least five minutes. There you go. Because then I can it just take it right back. Right back to the last location. Oh, ah, that fucker is ugly. Look at him. He loves his red berry pie. I get him two now in my career. My career with RuneScape Corporation. Officially joined the Blue Opal Squadron. I don't know what that is. I, I barely know what that is. Hmm. And giant, giant Dwarf is completed. Uh, yeah. 38 crafting. Oh. Let me uh, let me uh, guide you. Open up your map, okay? Mm -hmm. I'm looking Kingdom at Kingdom of Candoran is where you want to go, okay? Yep. Wait, just kidding. Like uh, our doom? Nope. Just kidding. I, I lied to you. It's an island. Okay. Go south of that. Keep running down south. South. Like, uh -huh. but, uh, okay. Go to you know when you see fell tip hills. Oh, the pills, yep. Okay. <laughs> Go way west. Okay. All the way west of the black. You until you hit Val Val Var a little more. Uh, oh, fuck. 
Oh, uh, yep. And then just go north of that. Oh, holy fuck. So there's a teleport to Corinth. Oh, this is where I can... That's where you do ah, the Lizardmen. I should have said that. Okay. It's lizards. south. It's southeast <laughs> yeah. of the Lizard. If you teleport to uh, Zarek's lookout, you'll be able to, mm -hmm. you'll be just north of the guild. Okay. So I can actually use that fucking. Yeah. Let's go. First hunter guild assignment. We got the rare piece of the creature from these nice, beautiful snowy butterflies, and now we're gonna head back. To the Hunter's Guild to turn this thing in. If you guys don't know what that is, I will show you right now. So the Hunter's Guild is basically like a new method for like hunter training. Um, you can do like basically these tasks as like Slayer. Um, and it's really flipping good for Iron Man. I thought that I had to have the uh, first light quest done or whatever quest done, but you do not have to have that done. You just have to have 46 Hunter to get in. That's on me. I had no idea. See, I'm a noob. But uh, yeah. So we're going to go take this little bird here because we did that quest, Children of the Sun, a couple episodes ago. We're going to take it all the way back here and we will do the quest to be able to take the birds down there soon. Um, I think it's like a... You have to kill some stuff that... I don't I don't know if my stats are good enough yet. You know, we're kind of noob. So we're just going to run. We're just going to fucking wing it. Run it. Run it down. But uh, you go turn this thing in and get some XP. And you get a little loot crate and you call it a day. I wish that was my genie. And where we're running to is all the way over here. Right in this little location, this Hunter Guild's cavern. That's where we will lay. So yeah, once we finish that quest back there that I was talking about, I think it's like a uh, fuck. What quest is it? I don't even remember the name of the quest. It's somewhere in there. What we, I think we started it. Let's see. Uh, Twilight's Promise. That's the one. Twilight's Promise. Once we finish that, we can unlock the uh, Quetzal over here and build that spot. Anyway, so we finished that, caught some butterflies, now we're down here. We're gonna go ahead and just talk to this young gent over here. Boom, 2.6k XP in a basic sack. Now we're gonna grab another rumor. And we get an odd horned grok. Odd horned grok, let's go. Oh my god, he jumped it. We can bring him over here. We're gonna get this guy. She's just a couple little bit of troubles. What up, tribesman? Tribesman? Dude, this guy's a fucking legend! Well, the fuck I should be doing Olympic high jumping. Ah, that's a death. Let's go. That's the Kebity Tuft. We're heading back. This is number three, I believe. Oh, frick. Gotta return. Alright, three rewards here. Number one, Hunter Spear Tips, Pyre Fox, Rock Hyatt, Maple Logs, Quetzal Feed, 1k GP, Mahogany Logs, Teak Logs, Blessed Bone Shards, Death Prayer XP. Back to more Dutchy guides here. So did you guys know if you make Opal Rings, which I'm doing right now, Opal Rings, guys, it's really easy to make, okay? You take those opal rings, and then you enchant them. It makes rings of pursuit. Now, class, does anyone know what the rings of pursuit do? Oh, oh man, I had one. A lie. No fucking idea. They make, when tracking, they make it possible to tr make the tracking, like, go from, give you, like, five, five of the things, so you just go to the end and get the kevit, and it has ten charges. Yeah. 
I don't pretty, know what any of that means. Pretty big, man. It's just for Hunter, dude. You wouldn't understand. Mm. You're not there yet. Nope. Just, uh, just a fun little fact for you guys. Just uh, doing some tracking, looking into some bushes, looking, checking some plants for some gnawing. You know how it be. Oh, thank God, dude. I was down to one health at one point. <laughs> oh. oh. On, on Iron Man? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I did stop playing my Iron Man because I needed to focus on the hunt list. That's fair, man. I respect oh, it. boy. It's okay. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Corrupted. Uh, let's give it a bow for reverence. Well, bam. Rune arrows. Oh, fuck. Under the stack. And attack! And that's how that's how it's done. Oh, oh nice. man, I'm not gonna lie guys. Razorback Kebbets tracking helps with these uh this plug in. Helps the plug if you if any of you guys want want to plug in, let me know, because it definitely helps when you do it. But uh my god that fucking blue. First butterfly. I get the freaking piece. Oh, Easy nice. game. The game is just simple at this point. We're going to release that sapphire glacial back into the wilderness from which it came. Be gone, beautiful butterfly. It's a lucky one. You might, I'm going to be like, <laughs> I feel like I'm Gandalf. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> what was he like again? <laughs> <laughs> you know, when he called the moths? Uh, and he jumps off the. That is uh, not at all what he sounded like. <laughs> what he, okay, then you tell me what he sounds like. He does Dude. like a. Like a <laughs> with like a like a like a light blowing. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it sounded like you were fucking choking on a dick or something. <laughs> no, it didn't. When he goes, yes, like, it <laughs> did. <laughs> Like a fucked up zombie. <laughs> Another slice of ham inbound. Xanic. Yep. We just saved him. Barely. There, Draz. We barely saved Xanic. Because you're a fucking hero. I'm a, I'm be your hero, baby. One quest point. 3k mining XP. 3k prayer XP. An ancient mace. And Dorgason train access. I can take a train that I have never done in the entirety of this game and 38 prayer. And I probably never will. Alright, so we got 10 of the hunter tasks done. And so now we got this basic Quetzal whistle blueprint. We are going to craft the whistle. What this does is it allows us to signal the bird we gotta get some charges first but it allows us to signal the bird and teleport back here it's gonna be making it a lot easier and it also tells us what our rumor is so pretty sweet just turned in that hunter rumor and we are 54 hunter looking at pretty spicy at the moment um i don't really know what my goal is here we got some of these hunter looter sacks, and I, I kept a couple coming to show you guys. Kind of like some of the loot that you get from them. So it's definitely some money drops, few logs, some mate, some feed, some more logs, some teak logs, more money, some blessed bone shards, which is how we'll be training our prayer eventually, and some more money. But yeah, I don't really know what my goal is at the moment. I'm just kind of getting hunter up uh, little by little. Probably going to go back to questing, do what I do best. We're really working on this bar, I just want to knock that grind out right away and kind of unlock some better content. Um, Grubby Gavin is currently working on fishing um, in our group storage. I'll give you a little update on that. Uh, we got a bunch of training food that he's kind of put in there. He's actually two sharks now. He thinks like, he think he hit 80 fishing. There's that dragon axe. Gorgeous. Uh, I think he's 80 fishing now. Draz is working on getting us magic short bows, which will be huge. A um, little bit of an upgrade. Oh, speaking of that, he already got him. My lord, he got the magic short bow. 
Uh, so we're just gonna go ahead and throw that right in here. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Um, I was doing a little bit of just AFK at the Ogre Warriors while I was editing a video or learning to edit a video. Haha. <laughs> um, as always, at the end of the, the video, I want to show you guys where our, our stats are. Currently, I'm at 868 total level. Here's my stats. Um, been kind of just training pretty much everything, doing a little AFK things here and there. I'm slowly getting agility up. As you guys know, agility fucking sucks. I don't even want to show that on here. Um, sitting at 68 quests completed, 125 quest points. Mr. Chief, Tess, get in my shot. Let me get in front of you. Um... I'm going to go ahead and start right off the bat by throwing up the Woke Boys scores. All right, so looking at the high scores here, you see Iron Woke Boy. He's got not a lot on the uh, the high scores chart here yet. I don't really know why he's not popping up on his other stats. Because you know he's been out here putting in the work. Um, anyways, we're going to move on to Grubby Gavin. He's looking pretty good. See all his stats up there. I don't know why Woke Boy doesn't. Anyways, but he's sitting at 640 total level. Got pretty much everything up and rolling. Highest stat is 76 fishing, 74 cooking. He is actually going to be our main supplier on the team of food. Um, he's already working on sharks, at, I think, at this point, by the time this video is even, even like finished. Um, moving on to the Jurazi 647. You can see he is sitting at pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Um, he's got 81 woodcutting, 80 fletching. So he's the one, obviously you saw, he made our magic short bows, and he's kind of just getting things going. He actually started doing some questing as well, so he's kind of catching up to me in terms of the quests, and we're just moving forward. But uh, yeah, thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe if you haven't yet, and if you have anything you'd like to have me add or have me do, have me add in, just please leave a comment below. I read and respond to every single one of them, so just let me know in the comments below, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Peace.